this time the Marx generator is set up to discharge through a small garden weed that's been planted in a small coffee cup. This was suggested to me by Green Silver, and to me it sounds like an excellent idea to try out the marks on. So a small nasty weed from the edge of the garden has been set up, and let's give this a shot and see what happens. Should be interesting. Thanks Green Silver for the suggestion. Everything's set up, and there's five inches of separation between the top of the plant and the bottom of the upper discharge electrode. Let's plug in and see what'll happen. There is a discharge occurring, but it's weak and not very visible, so I'm going to set up again. Let's try this again. This time I've watered the plant and I've lowered the electrode spacing. We'll see what happens. That ran a little more reliably, but let's keep going at this. thought I'd give the old weed a few more seconds of send-off before I go grab a new one from outside. I think it's time for a fresh garden weed. Okay, I've switched garden weeds. This one's taller and has a flower on top. This weed doesn't appear to be very conductive. The discharges are making it move and 
start to sag a little bit, but they're nearly invisible. Not much current is being drawn through the stem of the weed. It's seemingly acting like a high-value resistor. With the room lighting lowered considerably, the weak purplish discharge now becomes visible. The discharge isn't very loud owing to the restricted current. I would have expected the weed to draw a little better, but uh, it isn't. And there's plenty of water in the soil, so it's conductive at the bottom. Well, that was certainly interesting and worth trying. For this last clip, I'd actually taken a clip lead and hooked it from the bottom discharge electrode right to the stem of the plant so that uh, power was only flowing through the stem of the plant, not through the earth in the cup or anything else. The result was a still weak, thready, dim discharge, uh, the plant just seems to have a lot of uh, resistance. Thanks for watching, and there'll be plenty more to come, as always. I still have the garden weed I just attacked with the marks, but this time, just to finish up and get rid of it, I've got the two MOT capacitor charging power supply for my cat bank out. So I'm going to give this garden weed a shot of 4 kVAC. Ah, well, let's have it go. Well, and this is a little more effective. Here the AC is flowing through the dirt. Oh, there we go. Killed everything, even the breaker. Well, that's a good way to finish. Uh, this time the garden weed is really cooked thanks to 4K VAC. Here's the first garden weed back. I decided to give it a shot of uh, 4K VAC as well. Here goes. Again, we took out the breaker, but we fried the weed.